The first ever American to win gold in judo is Kayla Harrison, and she proudly carries that honor. I hope that, you know, little kids sign up and I hope that they want to be, you know, the next Kayla Harrison. But Harrison has new plans of her own. She is on her way to becoming a firefighter back home in Massachusetts. I'm pretty far in the process. I have to take my EMT sort of certification test and then if a job opens up um, in the town I live in, I will get an interview. And having an Olympic gold medal on your resume is probably going to help me a little bit. <laughs> Americans perform strong in the pool. Michael Phelps won his second gold medal of the Games by winning the 200-meter individual medley. He has won that event in three straight Olympics and now has 20 career medals. Tyler Clary won gold in the 200-meter backstroke. Clary set an Olympic record and plans to celebrate. I'm actually DJing here in London on Sunday night at a club called China White just up the street. Uh, that's going to be a lot of fun. That, that's going to be part of the celebration, and I'm, gonna, I'm planning a, a trip to Paris in, in, in the next week. Ryan Lochte finished in third place to win bronze in the 200-meter backstroke. He also won silver in the 200-meter IM behind Phelps. Lochte now has 11 career Olympic medals, five from London. I mean, I definitely wanted to do better. Uh, I mean, I had some ups and downs. But, I mean, for the most part, I'm coming home to my country with five Olympic medals, and that's something to be really proud of. Rebecca Sony continued her breaststroke dominance. Sony set a world record for the second night in a row by winning gold in the 200-meter breaststroke. Gabrielle Douglas is the women's gymnastics all-around Olympic champion. Her gold medal performance makes her the third American in a row to win the event and the first-ever African-American. Mark Carlson, the Associated Press, London.